Hands-free income, the outsourcing FAQ. You've no doubt heard people talk about outsourcing as a great way to grow your business. But maybe you have some questions about how you can start outsourcing smartly and effectively in your own business. Good news is, we've got answers. So, what can I outsource? You can outsource most any part of your business. Examples include content creation, such as blog articles, social media posts, newsletters, and more. Product creation, including lead magnets, tripwire products, core offers, and more. Video creation, from script writing to final production. Copywriting, that includes ads, sales letters, landing pages, and more. Traffic generation, including SEO, social media management, press release distribution, and more. Conversion testing and optimization, paid ad placement and management, affiliate program management, web design or development, graphics, voiceovers, marketing strategy or consultation, general research, customer service. Now, this is not even an exhaustive list. Point is, you can outsource almost anything. Which brings us to the next question. How do I decide what to outsource? Ask yourself these questions. Which tasks are high-value tasks? Focus on these ones yourself and outsource low-value tasks to others. Now, which tasks do you dislike doing? Outsource these. Which tasks would give you a better end result if you outsourced? Outsource tasks that you're not very good at doing and or those with a big learning curve. Now, which tasks will help your business grow faster? Outsource these. Next, how do I find freelancers? Now, once you figure out what to outsource, then you need to find freelancers to do these jobs. Now, here's where to find them. Post on freelancing sites such as Upwork.com, Guru.com, and Freelancer.com. Search Google, for example, search Hire Freelance Writer. Ask your colleagues for recommendations. Ask other contacts for recommendations, for example, blog about it, post on social media, etc. Or post a want ad. Now here's the next question. What are the keys to outsourcing smartly? You've probably heard the horror stories about freelancing, which you want to avoid. But to that end, follow these keys, tips, and best practices. Do your due diligence. Now research each potential freelancer extensively using Google, checking references, reviewing their portfolio, and checking their feedback ratings where applicable. Be sure to cross anyone off your list who has red flags, such as someone with poor reviews or someone who hasn't been in business very long. Also, start small. Even if a freelancer looks good on paper, you might not work together well. That's why you want to initially test a freelancer with small projects. If you work well together, then you can do bigger projects together. Other than that, create detailed briefs. Now, freelancers aren't mind readers. Now, if you want to get a good re end result, then you need to create clear, detailed briefs. They include details such as word counts, working titles, detailed outlines, and examples. Now, the more information you provide up front, the easier it is for your freelancer to give you what you want. Now, in conclusion, you just discovered some of the keys to outsourcing through the above question and answer session. So be sure to put these tips to work so you too can outsource effectively and smartly.